Hello everyone, this is Stephen IT Essentials again, coming back to you with another video. I know it's been a while since I created one, I figured I'd do one tonight for you guys, and it's going to be a PowerShell commandlet that I use at my job to determine if, if I get a user calling up and saying that their computer is running slow, CPU or memory is being utilized way too much. I can run this command, which I'm going to show you, which you can monitor it remotely. And you can see if something is going on. So I hope this command is useful to you. I use it every day at my job, and um, I'm going to show you guys how to do it. So here we go. I'm going to open up PowerShell, which you can see it's already open. And I use the integrated scripting environment because I like that uh, better. So it kind of helps you along the way as well. If people are not very good with command line, this kind of helps you out. So I'm going to paste, I'm going to copy and paste a command, let script, little script in there. As you can see, I'm using the invoke command along with the CN for computer name and then the computer name that you're trying to get to and stuff like that. So I'm going to change this to um, I'm going to change this to the to the machine that I want to get to and this is going to be that so it's going to be help desk so I'm running this in a virtual machine so when I run it it's going to give me the CPU and the memory utilization so here we go I'm going to hit enter and doing this remotely you can see if what the computer is complaining, you know, the, the user is complaining about. So you can sit there and watch this and get a little baseline going and this should help you out. And as you can see, we're running CPU, which is at 13% or I'm sorry, 3% and you get the memory usage. So if they say they're running low on memory, you can kind of watch this and see if it gets below a certain amount. And maybe the user would need more memory to the machine, you know, um, depending on how many applications they have open and stuff like that. So this right here is basically the same thing as you doing, um, let's just say, like a, um, you know, task manager. If you, open up, if you would open up task manager and you would look at the performance tabs, this is basically what you're seeing right here. Uh, beside it, the CPU utilization and also the memory as well. So of the available memory that's left in the system. So it's just a nice little command and you can just hit this little, the stop operation or control break to stop it. But this way here, you'll be able to see exactly what's going on in that user's machine. So I hope this little tip helps you guys. I'll put the script that I found in the comment section below uh, in my uh, description. And I hope you guys give this a try at your job. And maybe this might help you on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, I hope you find this video useful. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. And I hope to make some more of these little quick PowerShell script videos coming up here soon. I got a nice little collection of past year. I've been trying to work on it, trying to get a little bit better in PowerShell. And now I think I'm ready to display them out to the public a little bit. So maybe they can help you in your desktop support role. All right. So this is Stephen IT Essentials signing off. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you all for watching. Bye-bye for now. Like and subscribe. Thank you. Bye-bye.